Hello, my name is John Wilpers. I'm the founder of Degrees to Dreams, and I'm going to quickly walk you through the six-step process we've developed to help you land your dream job. Over the last five years, I've worked with more than 300 students and recent graduates to develop this system, and I can tell you that when people finish it, it works. So what are the six steps? First, a scrubbed and robust digital footprint. Second, two resumes, an ATS-friendly resume and an interactive resume, which we'll explain shortly. And third, a digital portfolio me site. Fourth, a passion blog about a niche in your field. Fifth, a social media campaign marketing yourself. And sixth, a powerful professional network built through informational interviews. Step number one, a scrubbed and robust digital footprint. 70% of employers have rejected candidates based on what they find online, but 70% have also hired candidates based on what they find online. So a scrubbed and robust digital footprint will ensure that employers will not find unpleasant things and will find positive content. The second step, two resumes, an ATS-friendly resume and an interactive resume. You need an ATS-friendly resume because all large companies and 75% of all mid-sized companies use an ATS or applicant tracking system to initially call resumes. The ATS will reject 75 to 90% of all resumes before a human even sees them. If your resume is not optimized for an ATS, you get rejected and you never know why. The interactive resume, you want to have one of those because all resumes look alike and you want to stand out. An interactive resume converts a look-alike, single-dimension resume into a multimedia experience with one QR code at the top linking to a video view and a video at the bottom linking to your best reference. Step number three is a digital portfolio, or me site, because a resume can only say so much about you. You want to make it as easy as possible for hiring managers to learn as much as they can about you in one place. Plus, a high-quality me site increases the odds that a hiring manager searching for your name will find your me site as the result of their search. Step number four is a passion blog about a niche in your field, because a blog simply is the most powerful job searching tool there is. Writing a blog means that your first contact with a potential employer is not as a sniveling supplicant begging for a job, but as a fellow in the field discussing key issues and trends. A passion blog helps you demonstrate your relevant skills, showcases your knowledge of the field, controls what people find out about you online, and enables you to meet and impress key players. It also makes you easy for employers to find you. It gets you past the gatekeepers straight to the decision makers. It creates a memorable personal brand, and it builds a powerful professional network. Step number five is a social media campaign marketing yourself, because social media today is the way to get the word out. You will promote yourself and your work via social media, Twitter, LinkedIn, Google+. You will also follow, comment, retweet, and otherwise promote and enhance the work of others, drawing yourself to their attention through smart, insightful interaction. And the last step, number six, is growing a professional network using informational interviews. Because networking and personal connections lead to jobs. Your buffed digital footprint, your me site, interactive resume, professional blog, and social media presence give you a great story to take on the road. So you take your portfolio on the road to the same people you've interviewed, followed, retweeted, and shared comments with. The informational interview is not a job search, but it's a connection-building, advice-seeking campaign. It cements you in the minds of these key players as a smart, hard-working, energetic, committed newcomer to their field. If you impress them here, they will then take your call when you graduate and when you are looking for tips on who's hiring, and it just might be them. If you do these six steps, you will stand out because 19% of students, just 19%, use it to discuss job openings. Only 26% use it to network or to research employers, and only and a full half don't use it at all. Here's another reason. Only 7% of job keep seekers have a blog. You will stand out. This is a process, though, and it is absolutely essential that you do each step in order before moving on. So let's get started. If you'd like to get started, contact me at john at degrees to dreams .com, and I can explain how we can help you land the job of your dreams. Thank you.